On this video, I'm talking Dollar Tree wallpaper. What can you use it for in your RV? Dollar Tree for the last year or so has been carrying these sheets. They have them in some pretty cool, fun patterns. I've seen other videos talking about them and they have way more colors at other Dollar Trees than they do mine. Mine is kind of limited. Today, I wanted to talk about if you bought quite a few of these and wanted to do a few modifications to your RV that is not permanent, I think these can be a great option. They did have this one that I thought was a very pretty neutral, kind of a marble look that you could use in your RV. They had these pretty butterflies that is blue and white. They even had this really pretty delicate looking one. And if you want more wood in your RV, they even have a wood color. Well, they had a dark wood color. This would be a light -co wood color, so you could lighten up your RV. Now, why I like I have seen a lot of people on YouTube, they have taken these and done like a whole big space. I think you probably could go and get it cheaper off of Amazon. I will link my favorite wallpaper that I've used in the RV down below. It has stuck really well in our bathroom. I have bought some. The one that I have over the glass in the RV, I had originally bought that and put it up in the bathroom and it peeled down after a few days so when it comes to wallpaper i can't say that it's going to stay up but i do know that the one that i have used behind the toilet in the bathroom it has been up almost two years i think now well the places that i would suggest that would be like a really cute area to use this pill and stick wallpaper would be one behind the tv now i have this pill and stick 3d wallpaper i guess tile i don't know what it was behind my tv but originally i did have wallpaper behind there i would think six or eight pieces of this would work good behind the tv so less than ten dollars you could change the look behind the tv another place that i absolutely love using pill and stick wallpaper is on the glass in the rv like I said, the one that I have on the glass, it would not stick to the wall in the bathroom. It peeled down after a few days, but it has been up, gosh, probably three years or more on the glass and it hasn't come off at all. So wall, pill and stick wallpaper sticks really good to glass or mirrors. And what I loved is it made a cabinet that you could see the mess inside of it. You took this wallpaper, put it on there and it totally made it where you couldn't see the mess that was behind the glass. Now, I was even looking, I think this would even be great. Now, for me, I wouldn't do this because I love our mirrors in the bedroom. I use them all the time, but I know a lot of people hate those mirrors. Well, you could take probably about eight or 10 pieces of this. For our mirrors, I kind of just guessed about how many pieces it would take to do redo our mirrors. You could just stick this up there. I even think that if you had like a window, a small window, I don't know that I would do a big window, but if you had like a small window that you did not want people to see in all the time and that you didn't want to see out either, <laughs> you could definitely put this up because you could see the pretty pattern in it, but then the people outside would just see white. And that would be like a quick, inexpensive way to fix a window. Another place that I would suggest that you could use this on in our bathroom. The cabinet below our sink in the bathroom, it had, I guess just from the water getting on it, it was kind of, I'm not going to say that it was peeling because peeling was not the right word, but the finish was coming off of it a little bit. And I took wallpaper and covered the insert in it and made it where you can't see that. And that wallpaper has stuck there very well. So you could definitely take this and fix it in the insert to add a little bit of extra style there. Another place that I think this would be pretty if you wanted to add a little extra pretty style 
if you had maybe you had an older RV or if you just don't like the bottom of each of your cabinets you could put this in the bottom of your drawers or your cabinets and that would look really pretty as well if you wanted to make that kind of a prettier space another place that I think that you might could use this peel and stick removable wallpaper is if you have steps and it is a smooth surface behind it you could add that to the steps the back of the steps and add a little color to those as well let me know what ideas that you have for this peel and stick wallpaper from Dollar Tree till next time like and subscribe